Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing the brand new Teaching Textbooks 4.0 update. I'm giving you guys my review and there's going to be a giveaway that you don't want to miss, so stay tuned. So if you are not familiar with teaching textbooks, teaching textbooks is an amazing math curriculum. We have used it for years in our home and I am so happy that we found this at the beginning of our homeschooling journey. Uh, teaching textbooks goes from level three all the way up through pre-calculus. So you've got your standard levels, three, four, five, six, seven. You've got pre-algebra, algebra, geometry, everything that you need to teach math all the way up through pre-calculus is in this curriculum. Um, it does all of the hard work for you as the parent and the teacher, which is amazing from the teaching of concepts and the lessons themselves to the grading of the lessons and the quizzes to compiling it all in a grade book and giving you a course average. It's all there for you. So it is really, really teacher friendly. It's really great. I love it so much because my kids are able to work independently. And then if they do encounter a problem, I'm able to go back and help them problem solve by going back through the lesson. I can go in their grade book and see exactly where the problem was. It's super helpful for me as the parent. The lessons are not exhaustive. They are a really good length. They're not too long. They're not too short. They follow the spiral approach. So they're practicing concepts over and over again. They're encountering things they're familiar with as well as practicing new concepts. And you can easily do this in one school year's length of time and it also includes up to three months of a pause feature so each subscription you can pause anywhere from one week at a time all the way up to a total of three months and I've said this many times before and I will link my other reviews from the past up here in the corner if you want it follow my teaching textbooks rabbit trail, but teaching textbooks has been an absolute game changer in our homeschool. It was recommended to me years ago by a friend who was just hearing my hearts cry. Like I really was struggling with my relationship with my oldest, our, our teacher, our teacher student relationship, which of course when you're homeschooling is a parent child relationship. And I was really just frustrated that we were butting heads when it came down to math. It was a really difficult position that I was in and she suggested teaching textbooks. She had used it for years for her older kids and it was just an absolute perfect fit. So we started right at level three and we have been so happy with it since then. So the new teaching textbooks 4.0 update has some amazing new features. It's the same great teaching textbooks lessons, but it has some great new features that makes it a really user-friendly experience for everyone. And I'm going to go ahead and start telling you what some of my favorite new features are in the new 4.0 upgrade. So the most highly anticipated update that I think everybody was waiting for is that you can use the new 4.0 pro program across all platforms. You can use it on your desktop as you were before, although you download it as a new, it doesn't use flash anymore. So you download it onto your desktop or you can download it as an app to tablets, phones, as long as it's not an old device and a, a much older device, it should work across any tablet or phone. Uh, and then a great new feature is that you can download a few lessons at a time onto the tablet or the phone and you no longer have to stay connected to internet access. So for us, if we're driving in the car somewhere or we're doing the run around, we've got dance or karate, my kids can sit in the lobby and do a lesson while their other sibling is in a lesson themselves, um, which is a great new feature to not necessarily need to be connected to the internet. Uh, for example, my son a couple of weeks ago was in the middle of a lesson, didn't want to stop his lesson. He was very proud of himself for getting it done early in the day. And I had to go drop them off at my parents' house because I had to run some errands. So he was able to take the lesson in the car with him, continue working on it in the car and then do it at my parents' house, which was a great feature for him. He got it done within the first two or three minutes of being there and he just continued on from our house, which was great. And then when you reconnect to internet, um, it, up, it uploads the grades. And so when you get back on say a desktop or another phone, it's all right there in the grade book. You don't have to do anything manually. Uh, it keeps everything compiled for you, which for me is super helpful because I'm not very tech savvy. So everything about the new update is very user friendly if you are like me and not super techie. One of my kids' favorite new components of the update is the scratch pad. So if they are doing work on a phone or a tablet, 
not really so much on a desktop because you're using a mouse although if you have one of those desktops like i do where it can be a touch screen or a, a standard mouse and keyboard desktop um, it does work on that uh, but the scratch pad is so neat it eliminates having to use a piece of scrap paper they're able to pull the scratch pad up while they're doing their lesson and figure out the work right there it's just a digital scratch pad it's an amazing new feature and it has really for some reason, that has been the biggest game changer for my son. That ease of use has just helped him so much. He's not, he doesn't have papers and pens and he's not like going from the screen to the paper, trying to plug things in. It's, it's all right there in his line of view and it has been so helpful for him. He loves that so much. My daughter loves it as well. And then I love that I'm not finding math sheets all over the house. It's really funny, um, but I would find their scratch paper all over the house. So it's really great, a great new feature, especially if you are a family who does like to be paperless as much as possible. So that scratch pad is really great and really fun. Another new feature that they've also added is um, they've updated the ebook to where it's much easier to search and print things. Sometimes I do like to change change it up a little bit instead of doing it on a tablet or on the computer, uh, to printing the ebook, letting them work on it like a standard paper and pencil kind of lesson, uh, prints the lesson out for them so they can read the lesson instead of hearing the lesson, and then they can also do the work as if they were working in a workbook. And so they've updated that as well to make it easier to search and to print. So some of the really fun stuff for kids, they have updated and remastered some of the visuals and the sound. So everything is much more crisp, it's a little cleaner, um, it's more up to date with the times, and the audio is much better. So it's still the same lessons, still the same concepts. It's not gonna be too much of a change if your kids get used to something and they don't like too much change. It's still the same style of teaching, the same content, but it's all just been remastered, so it's much nicer and newer. Um, and then also there are updated uh, buddies and wallpapers and new stickers, which is really fun for them. And they can earn some stickers throughout their lessons. Um, they win them as prizes, which is really, really fun for them, especially if they are younger. My son, that's like probably his most favorite part about this is all of the new stickers and getting to select which ones he wants to use and earning the new ones. It makes it like a game. It's just really interactive. And that is a great new feature in the 4.0 update. The update was very easy for me to download and really easy for my kids to get used to. And I just wanted to throw that in there because even though I do work on YouTube, I've mentioned many times before that when it comes down to digital stuff and tech stuff, I have tech support like on speed dial on my phone. I am not good when it comes to computer stuff. And so I was a little nervous when it came time to downloading this, especially downloading it on an iPad, trying to download the new update on the computer, wanting to have it on multiple devices. Um, but it was so simple. It was just easy to follow instructions. It took about five minutes total and it was very, very, very user friendly. And one time when I was at my parents' house, I realized I had forgotten my iPad. I wanted the kids to do some work while they were being babysat. I I pulled my parents iPad out downloaded their lessons or downloaded the app really quickly for each of their levels and again it took less than five minutes and it was just they were able to just get going right away so I wanted to throw that in there in case the words update or upgrade make you really nervous when it comes down to tech stuff it is really really very user friendly if you are not very tech savvy and of course teaching textbooks is a really helpful company so you can call them anytime if you have any questions or you're having some issues with downloading or um, updating the app once you have it downloaded. So let me talk about why I personally love teaching textbooks and then I'm gonna tell you uh, some of the reasons my kids gave me when I asked them why they love teaching textbooks so much. So the first reason that I really love teaching textbooks and why we've stuck with it for so long is just because it takes such a weight off of my shoulders from the lessons to the grading. Um, and like I had said earlier, if my kids need help, I can go back and go back through the lesson. I can see where they're struggling. I can see the specific question, whether they used a hint or not, whether they used the second chance or not. That's really helpful for me. And then as a last resort, if I'm not able to help them, they are such an amazing company and they do offer free tutoring as a last resort if you cannot find 
what you are looking for if you're really struggling with a concept and your student just needs a little bit more help you can always call them for some free tutoring which i think is so wonderful because that's really unheard of when it comes to curriculum to have a company offer free tutoring as a last resort so i really love that feature so much and while we haven't used the tutoring yet knowing that it's available to us if we can't figure out what we're looking for especially as my kids get older and they get into some of the more difficult to teach i.e i've been out of that for too long to teach it kind of levels um i just love knowing that that's there and available to me as the teacher and to them as the students as well i also really love that you're able to change up where and how you're doing the lessons so i've mentioned this uh, before the 4.0 update even became available, but even back when it was just the 3.0 program, we would often print the lessons if I felt like my kids needed something that wasn't as distracting or we were on the go. Sometimes it's just nice to change it up, do it pencil and paper style. So I love that you can change up how you're doing the lessons, whether you're wanting to do it you know, on the patio, on an iPad, if they want to do it in the car on my phone, if they are um, wanting to do it traditionally, sitting at the computer with a piece of scrap paper, if they really want to do that, or if they want me to print the lesson out so we can sit side by side and work through it together. I like that there are different options and that it can all be, you know, kept together in the digital gradebook and you don't have to worry too much about, um, you know, oh, well, we did it on the tablet this time and now I did it on the phone and now I've got to plug the lessons in. It's very simple, so user-friendly, and they can just use it as needed in different forms. Of course, speaking of the gradebook, the gradebook is just so helpful. When it comes down to end of the year records, all I have to do for them is just print their gradebook at the end of the year and print the quizzes uh, gradebook at the end of the year. It's got everything already compiled from the percentage score to how many they got right and wrong. And it's just so perfect. That's super helpful for me as a mom of many children to be able to just click print and have their math kept in their portfolio just like that. And then of course, another part that I love is that I can control the sounds and the second chance, uh, whether they, they, you know, they can try something a second time, whether that be in the lessons or whether that is on the quizzes i can choose if they get a second chance if they get it wrong or if they just get it wrong um, after the first attempt which is really neat um, if i feel like they need to be on their toes a little more i can turn off the second chances for quizzes or problems and they'll be a little bit more focused which i think is wonderful and I also like that if i just feel like they need less distraction i can control um, how much of the fun stuff really they're able to have or not on a particular day um, my kids are so enthusiastic about doing math especially since the update i'm not sure specifically what it was but they are working faster they're way more excited they already loved it so much but they're way more excited and their younger siblings i forgot to mention this earlier Eli has used the free trial a couple of times now because he is just so eager to be finished with his current work so he can get to level three and start teaching textbooks as well. The kids love cheering them on in the bonus rounds. They love listening to their buddies. So they have an audience sometimes when they're doing math just because there is so much enthusiasm in my house for teaching textbooks. And then finally, the teaching style. They teach so well. They use the spiral approach. So they're practicing concepts over and over again. And once they seem to master a concept, they have not come to me for more help. It is, it is done well. They teach well. And my kids have really been able to master concepts by using that spiral approach. So now that you've heard from me as the parent, teacher, why? I love teaching textbooks so much. I thought you guys may want to hear directly from the source if you are wondering if this is going to be a good fit for your students, what my kids had to say about why they love teaching textbooks so much. So I asked them each to share three things with me that are their favorite things about teaching textbooks. So the first thing that they shared was that it teaches really well. So I think what my daughter meant when she said that was just that she uh, feels like she's getting complete lessons and concepts and she's not confused. She is the type of student who just likes to know that she knows what she knows. She doesn't like to feel uneasy about concepts and lessons and so she 
when she finishes her quiz or she finishes her lesson, if she gets, you know, a 95, she is content with that. She knows she knows what she knows and she feels like she's been taught well. So that's really important to her. And that is of course very important to me as well that they feel confident in what they are learning. The next thing that they said was that they love the interaction and the stickers and that they have control over which ones they do and don't use. That's really fun for them. They like to change that up every time they sit down for a lesson. Um, and it just makes it more fun for them. Uh, the next thing that I was told was that they love the scratch pad. So the scratch pad, like I said earlier, was a game changer for me. It's a game changer for them as well. They really enjoy having that available to them and they use that at every single time they're doing a lesson. Next, um, really important to my son was that it feels like a game. He loves math. He feels like he's being rewarded by being able to play math um, and do the lessons. It's really interactive, feels like a game to him and just it's fun. And that was, that was something I wasn't expecting him to say was that math is fun, but to him teaching textbooks 4.0 is just really fun. Um, and then kind of on the flip side uh, of it being so fun is that it makes him feel like he has got a lot of responsibility and independence. So even though he really enjoys it, he also says it makes him feel like a big kid being able to do these lessons start to finish on his own and you know go off, complete his lesson, log in, do his lesson, tell me his score and not have anyone hovering over him. Uh, he feels very independent. And then this is the, the one I was expecting my son said he loves the bonus rounds and of course like i said earlier the whole family gathers around him while he's doing them and cheers him on and everyone's like ah five four three so the bonus rounds are really great for that it really helps with some quick thinking and it's very very fun for them so uh, those are what my kids top favorite things are about the teaching textbooks 4.0 update. So before I let you go, I have a couple of things I want to tell you about. Of course, something that I've mentioned before, but it's still available with the new 4.0 platform is the free trial. This is a amazing free trial. Do not let this go. If you are considering teaching textbooks and aren't sure if it will work for your family or not, it is a no credit card required, no time limit free trial where you get the first 15 lessons. You can work on it at your own pace. You can do multiple levels if you're trying to place your child. And then if you choose to go ahead and use teaching textbooks, those first 15 lessons, their grades will transfer over into the new uh, subscription if you choose, if you want them to transfer over. Or you can start fresh if you want to, but if you feel like your child has gone through all 15 lessons, did them well, and you want them to start at lesson 16, those grades will transfer over when they start their subscription. Next is the large family plan. Um, the large family plan is great if you have multiple students, so be sure to check that out. And then finally, a giveaway. Teaching Textbooks has very kindly offered me two subscriptions to give away to you guys. So all of the info for the giveaway is in the description box down below, and two of you are going to win a one-year subscription to a level of your choice. So like I said, all the info is down below in the description box. So thank you so much, Teaching Textbooks, for sponsoring today's video and for partnering with me on that giveaway. That's a very exciting giveaway, and I'm really excited to see who wins those one-year subscriptions. I hope you guys take advantage of that free trial. If you are still trying to figure out if this is right for you, it's a great time to take advantage of that free trial and utilize it in the next school year if you are interested. And if you guys like teaching textbooks, give this video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of teaching textbooks is. All right, I will see you guys soon. Bye guys.